developing story is 2,000 gas complaints. Atmos Energy says its phones are ringing off the hook. 16 WABT's Tammy Eswick is live in one Jackson neighborhood. Tammy, what caused all the problems? Yeah, Atmos Energy tells us tonight that a contractor that gives them the gas added too much of a chemical that creates that rotten egg smell. Tonight, they're answering dozens, if not hundreds, of calls. Emergency and Atmos crews are scrambling, dealing with thousands of gas leak calls. Was it louder than usual? Yes. When we walked in the house, we could smell it. We, we could. That's so it was what, noticeable. It was noticeable, yes. Atmos says out of about 2,000 calls, they have found at least 10 real broken lines with gas that could be dangerous. But they say the bigger problem is a chemical odor that's added to the gas. Natural gas, it's colorless, clear, and odorless. That's why most natural gas companies will add a scent, like rotten egg, to the batch. That way people can smell it. Excess odor was put in the gas lines. That excess odor is making customers worried, and it's that bad mix that's flowing all over our area. Kind of like that egg, rotten egg kind of smell. And I understand you guys bought uh, this odor from a different company that, than you usually buy from. Yes, the company uh, put the odorant in the lines. It wasn't one of our technicians that did that, and um, we've, we found that a bit too much was placed in the lines. Atmos says a separate company supplies their gas, and in this last batch, they added too much odor-making chemical. Centerpoint Energy has the same type of problems. Monday, Ridgeland Emergency crews evacuated Ann Smith Elementary and a Marriott Hotel on Ridgewood Court after workers smelled what they thought was a leak. Centerpoint and Atmos say they have dozens of people in the field. From North Mississippi, from our, some of our other areas, we've called several in. The company say if you smell that rotten egg smell, you should leave your home and call 911. Yeah, so we talked to Atmos Energy about where a lot of these calls are coming from. They say they're coming from Northeast Jackson, east over Lake Heiko, Woodland Hills. Fondren. Those are some of the areas that they've gotten those calls from so far. Now, Stephanie and Megan, we also asked Atmos officials, when do they expect all of this to dissipate, all of this smell? They say it's going to take some time, but could not give us a specific time frame. Live in Jackson, Tammy Eswick, 16 WAPT News. Okay, Tammy, thank you.